Seattle Seahawks have extended their general manager, John Schneider, and he is extended through the 2027 draft. So he's going to be here for quite a long time. And speaking of quite a long time, get this, him and Pete Carroll were hired 11 years ago, which is, you know, this is incredible. And in that 11 years, a lot of things have happened. You know, biggest one is the Legion of Boom, like we talked about in the last video. Uh, two Super Bowl appearances. They won 48 and lost 49. Five division titles, 10 playoff victories, and nine straight winning seasons, which out of those 11, which is the longest in the NFL. And by the way, something I found pretty interesting, this is a move that interrupted the Lions as they were planning to high, uh, as they were planning to acquire John Schneider as their next general manager. That's, that's pretty good thinking right there. I got I to gotta give credit to the Seahawks for that. Uh, and this was reported by Ian Rappaport and written by Adam Meyer. So Mario, I, I'm going to be honest with you. I think this is, a, this is one of the better ideas for the Seahawks. No, I absolutely, I completely agree. John Schneider has did a great job with this team. Um, a lot of guys, like late wise that he drafted, have been doing very good. Like the, like I mean, the uh, Shaquille Griffin has been a great corner for that team. Uh, Shaquille Griffin has been a great special team for that uh, special team player for that team. Obviously, Russell Wilson is the one we look at the most. You know, he was a third round pick. DK Metcalf um, was a good late round was a good late round pick, which honestly he should have been a first round pick. Even from his, I don't know why he wasn't, but regardless of that, it was a good late round pick by them. Um, they did good in the offseason grabbing guys like uh, Carlos Dunlap and Jamal Murray and getting all these guys. So that he's done good. Here's my problem with John Schneider. John Schneider cannot draft a talent in that first round. He can't. His, ta- his, his first round drafting, it's just bad. Like, I got to be honest. Like, like, not that the players are bad. But they're just not – it's it's like the Eagles. They can't draft a first-round guy that can make a huge impact. All these guys, if you look at them making a huge impact, it's all late-round picks. And that's even back when the Legion of Boom days were going on. Cam Chancellor, Brandon Brown, and Richard Sherman, and Earl Thomas, all those guys were late-round picks. Third-round, fourth-round, fifth-round, all those guys were those types of picks. So, I mean, when you really when you really look at it, that's my problem with John Schneider on the Seattle Seahawks. He – First round picks are just not his thing. He doesn't know how to draft them correctly. Now, will that change over time? I hope so. I hope that now since he got an extension, he is he will be able to draft good talent in the first round. Late round, he's absolutely great. He's good, he's great at doing that. You know what I'm saying? Between the Griffin brothers, DK Metcalf, the Legion of Boom, you name it, he's done great in the late rounds. Uh, Jordan Reed this year for their defensive tackle has been great. But when it comes to first round picking, he does, it doesn't seem like he, he's able to click with somebody, and that's my issue with him. But other than that, he's been a great GM for the Seattle Seahawks. Obviously, five division titles and ten playoff victories. Don't forget about the Super Bowl victory and the two Super Bowl appearances. Those obviously, those are obviously another part of, of that story. He's been doing a great uh, he's been doing a great job as GM. It's just the only improvement I want to see from him is is ha- drafting first round picks that can make a big impact. But with that being, other than that, with that being said, congratulations to John Schneider on his new extension, and congratulations on staying with the Seattle Seahawks. Yeah, right. And I'll go on back to what you said about drafting the first round, uh, first round talent. I think that's something he has to, he has to um, look into, especially this this uh, upcoming. That's going to be a lot of great first round talent in here, especially if you're going to be here until the 2027 uh, draft. You gotta really, you gotta, I gotta really work, work. Uh, excuse me, look hard into it. And like you said, you know, he's great. He's great at drafting late round picks. And you're absolutely correct. But you know, like, like I said, you're gonna be here for an extra seven more years. You've already been here for eleven years. It's almost twenty years you're gonna be with this team, uh, if that even happens. You got, you know, all you gotta do is just study who, who's going in, who's entering the NFL draft in the first round. And, and I think this year it might be a bit easier because there's going to be so much great talent. And they're already, and they're all, uh, there always is. Now, I'm not going to say yeah. that there isn't, but this year is just a little bit more exciting. Um, but with that said, you know, other than that, like you said, he's had, you know, he's had great success with this team. Yeah. Um, not like they had any before that, but he turned that around and, and you know, made a, made a legacy out of this team. And, and you know, that, that deserves a lot of respect. Uh, so with that said, congratulations to John Schneider and the Seattle Seahawks for his extension. And we'll see what it goes from here.